Pain Lotus Beth at Amnesty International, Don't Paris Lotus Drug War Info, Manila, Philippines Presidential Postman Salvador Pain Lo on Wednesday urged Amnesty International to stop peddling bogus information on the Duterte administration's war on drugs. In a statement, Pain Lo hit the London-based group for insisting that the drug war has claimed the lives of 27,000 drug personalities. The palace official was reacting to Bush Olano, Amnesty Philippines Section Director, who asked him to do his homework first by reading the group's report on the drug war before making any statement. Olano said the figures cited in the report came from the government itself, particularly the Philippine National Police, PNP. Read, claiming that he had surely done his homework, Payne Lowe said the group's drug war death toll of 27,000 is when these lie and is a part of the false narrative against the anti-narcotics campaign supposedly peddled by the president's critics. This is when big lie and part of the false advocacy widely peddled by the president's critics and detractors, considering that those who have been neutralized in the anti-illegal drug campaign are less than a fifth of this loaded figure, Payne Lowe said. He then pointed to opposition candidates in the recently concluded midterm elections as the ones who foisted the lie but were mercilessly repudiated by the electorate in the polls. Their mask of righteousness has been ripped apart, he said. Amnesty International cannot parrot the bogus information it gets from the anti duter forces and gets away with it. It cannot rapidly throw accusations without them showing credible proof of their authenticity, came low stress. The palace official further asked the human rights group to cite fast and figures on the names of the alleged 27,000 extrajudicial deaths. Otherwise, their failure will only validate the grotesque falsity of their claim and blaze it with condemnable malice, he said. Flash E, thank you for watching. Please subscribe.